Or you be the devil, then I'll be, I'll be the good guy. I'm just trying to give you credit. But the enemy, you're trying to go that way. And But the enemy will try to block you. And if he can, to remind you. But you know in your past, right? In your past and in your past. And then here you will think you're feeling all guilty and condemned. But the Bible says, in the Romans chapter 8, there in verse 1, there is therefore now. Everyone say now. That's your present. That's your present. There is therefore now. No condemnation. What does that mean? The condemnation represents my past. But the now represents my present. And God says, I stop the devil in your present from trying to rule your future with your past. No future. If I stop here and don't press on, there's no future. The devil didn't do it. I did. Y'all don't want me to stay here because there's another level of revelation that I, I can share with you about for the devil to really distort and disrupt your future and who you are in God right now and everything God has wired you to become because his word is in you. The devil will have to go all the way back to the Garden of Eden, go past you and you being conceived in your mother's womb and go all the way back to the Garden of Eden and stop God from doing something down there in the dust and making some kind of image and some kind of form.
Expectation of watching God work will not let me die in the process. Yeah. 